Okay. Okay, I have four stories today. Not brand new. Sometimes I, I do brand new stories, right? And you have to tell me whether you like them or you don't. But first we're going to start off with Bear Snores On. Do you know how to snore? Yeah. Well, we're going to listen to Bear snore right now. What do you think he's going to be doing? All right. In a cave, look at that nice cave, in the deep, deep woods, in the deep, dark lair, through the long, cold winter, sleeps a great brown bear. Can you see him in there? The cave looks cozy, doesn't it? Cuddled in a heap with his eyes shut tight, he sleeps through the day and he sleeps through the night. The cold winds howl and the night sounds growl. But the bear snores on. Bear. An itty bitty mouse, pitter pat, tiptoe, creep crawls in the cave from the fluff cold snow. Mouse squeaks, ah, too damp, too dank, too dark. So he lights wee twigs with a small hot spark. The coals pip pop and the wind doesn't stop. But Bear, what? Snores on. Doesn't wake him up. Mouse didn't wake him up, did he? Two glowing eyes sneak peek in the den. Mouse cries, who's there? And a hare hops in. Ho, oh, Mouse says hare, long time no see. So they pop white corn and they brew black tea. Do you think Bear woke up? Mouse sips with slurps, hair burps, big eh, burps. But bear, what? Snores on. That bear is not going to wake up. A badger scuttles by, sniff sniffs in the air. I smell yummy yums. Perhaps we can share? I've brought honey nuts, badger says with a grin. Let's divvy them up, cozy down, and dig in. And they nibble, and they munch, with a chew, chomp, crunch. But the bear snores on. You're right. A gopher and a mole tunnel up through the floor. Then a wren and a raven flutter in through the door. Mole mutters, what a night! What a storm, twitters Wren, and everybody clutters in the great bear's den. Do you think Bear got up? No. No? You think he's still sleeping? They tweet and they titter. They chat and they chitter. But the bear snores on. In a cave in the woods, a slumbering bear sleeps through the party in his very own lair. Look at the party going on in the den. How does it look? Looks like a fun party, huh? But bear is still what? He's still sleeping. Hare stokes the fire and mouse seasons snoo stew. Then a small pepper flake makes the bear, what? Uh, 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 chew! He blows and he sneezes and the whole crowd freezes. <sighs> They're frightened he's going to wake up. Think he will? And the bear wakes. 
bear now and he snarls and bear roars and he rumbles bear jumps and he stomps bear growls and he grumbles You've snuck in my lair, and you've all had fun. But me, I was sleeping, and I have had none. And he whimpers, and he moans, and he groans, and the bear blubbers on. Mouse squeaks, don't fret, don't fuss. Look, see? We can pop more corn. We can brew more tea. Bear gulps and he gobbles. He sighs with delight. Then he spins tall tails through the blustery night. When the sun peeks up on a crisp, crisp clear dawn, bear can't sleep. But his friends, what? Snore on. So they all woke Bear up, and when Bear finally woke up, what happened? Everybody went to sleep, and that's the end. That was a silly story. Do you like it? Did you like it? Yes. Thumbs up? I say definitely a thumbs up. I liked Bear a lot. Yeah, you do? You like it too? Okay. All right. Who's ready for story number 200? No. Just number two, right? Do you like to hear about bears again? No. This is a very, very silly story, and it's very old. Do you see how old this book is? It's very well loved. It's one of my favorite stories called Be um, Bread and Honey. And it's a story about a bear, but it's very, very important that you watch the pictures, okay? Because the pictures will change on every page. And you'll see what bear does. Ready? See? It's even broken in there. Are you ready to hear this story? Yeah. Okay. Called Bread and Honey. One morning, when Bear was getting ready for school, his mother took out a loaf of fresh bread out of the oven. Can I have a piece, asked Ben. What do you think she said? She said, the bread is too hot now, said his mom, but you can have some when you get home. <gasps> With honey on top, asked Ben. Yes, said his mother. With lots of honey on top. Okay, said Ben, and he hurried off to school. That day, Ben painted a picture of his mother. What do you think? Is it a nice picture of his mom? Yeah. Looks good to me. Take a good look at it, though. See what his mom looks like. All right. When the bell rang, Ben decided to go home because he wanted his bread, right? Okay. On the way, he stopped to show the picture to Owl. I love it, said Owl, but you made the eyes too small. I have my paint box with me, said Ben. Maybe I can fix that. So he's going to fix it. Let's see what he did. What did he do? Did he make his eyes bigger? He did. All right. Fine work, said Owl. Great job. At the riverbank, Ben showed the picture to Alligator. <gasps> I just love it, said Alligator, but the mouth needs to be much, much bigger. Oh, well, he has his paints with him. How's that, asked Ben. Much better, said Alligator. What did he do? He made a bigger mouth, right? Okay. A little way down the path, Ben met Rabbit and showed her the picture. Oh, I love it, said Rabbit, but you know what? The ears are too short. 
Oh, that's so easy to fix, said Ben. Ah! How does that? Does he look like the mom? How's that, said Ben? Wonderful, said Rabbit. That is just wonderful. No. Mm. When Ben showed, uh-oh, when Ben showed Elephant his picture, Elephant said, what do you think she said? I love it, but the nose is just too small. And once again, Ben took out his paints. How's that, asked Ben. Unforgettable, said Elephant. How does it look? Does it look like Ben's mom? Uh -huh, it's starting to look very silly, isn't she? An elephant and a rabbit. An elephant and a rabbit and an alligator and an owl. Okay. Then Ben showed, uh-oh, his picture to Lion. And Lion said, I love it. But you forgot to put a big fluffy mane. How's that, asked Ben. What do you think? Good picture? <laughs> it's a picture to be proud of, said Lion. Lion thinks it's beautiful. Uh-oh. Now what? When Ben was almost home, he showed Giraffe his picture. I just love it, said Giraffe, but the neck is too short. So Ben took out his paints again. How's that, he asked. What do you think? Is it good? A good picture? Perfect, said Giraffe. That is perfect. Ben ran the rest of the way home. When he got there, he said to his mother, look what I made, a picture of you. I love it, said his mother. Just the way it is, asked Ben. What do you think his mom said? Just the way it is. And she hung it on the refrigerator. How does she look? Does it look like Ben's mom? It looks funny. It looks funny, huh? But his mom loved it. So that's all that counts, right? And then, I bet, Ben got a thick slice of homemade bread with lots of what on top? Honey, would you like that? Yeah. Honey on top of hot bread? Yeah. This is a really hard one because it's an old book. But it's called, What Am I? All right, so I'll give you the clue and then you can listen. All right, let's, oh, you probably never even know this one. Listen, tick, tock, tick, tock. Yeah is the sound I make or brr, 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 to help you wake. What am I? What helps you wake up in the morning? A clock. A clock. A clock. Let's yeah. see. Let's see. I'll close my eyes because I don't think it's a clock. I think it's a kitten that comes to lick your face and he says brr. Ready? Are we going to see a kitty? Say kitten. Kitten. Ah, clock. You are right. And I was not right. I thought it was a kitty licking my cheek. Okay. To guess what I am is easy as can be. Your sock goes on your foot and your foot goes into me. What am I? What does your foot go shoe. into? Shoe. Shoe. You think it's a shoe? Yeah. I think it's a telephone. No. <laughs> I'm going to close my eyes. Tell me if it's a... You want to start saying telephone now? No. Telephone. Yeah. I said telephone shoe. phone? No. No, it's a shoe. It has ties. All right. 
I don't think you're going to get this one. I don't think that's you will. I don't think so. Though we jingle and jangle, that's jingle. not what we're for. You need one of us to unlock your door. A key. What am I? A key. A key? Yeah. Mm, I think it's bells. No. I'm going to close my eyes. Ready? Are you just ready? Get ready to say bells. Ready? No. Key. Bells. No. Ready? Let's practice. Bells. Let's practice. One, two, three. Bells. bells. All right. Let's see. Ready? Bells. Key. Oh, my goodness. I thought it was bells. I'm just the worst guesser. All right. I ring until you pick me up. You hold me to your ear. Then someone who is far away seems to be right here. What am I? Hmm. No, look, it looks like a can. I think it's a tin can with a, with a um, rope in it. You think it's a telephone? All right, I'm going to say tin can. Ready? Tin can. <laughs> Did you ever see a phone like that? <laughs> Did anybody ever see a phone like that? No. You have? I You did? Okay. All right, listen to the next clue. Here we go. I hang from a bar or sometimes even a tree. Ask a friend for a push when you ride on me. What am I? A swing? Do you ask a friend for a push when you're on a swing? You do? I think it's a train. All right, ready to say train? No. I'm a good guesser. No. <laughs> ready? I'm the best, thank you. Ready? A uh, train. A swing. You, a oh, let's call it a train swing. I like that. No. <laughs> then I'll be right, right? No. All right. Just a swing, just Oh, okay. Are you ready for this one? I don't think you're gonna get it. I think it's, I think it's, I, I think it's really, really, really hard. Are you ready? I know. All right, listen. You'll find us on your birthday cake. Each one of us a glow. Close your eyes and make a wish. Then take a breath and. Blow. Candle. Candle. Are there candles on your birthday cake? Yeah. I think it's a cake. No. I blow on my cake like that. <laughs> like that. Ready? Are you ready to say cake? Yeah. Here it is. It's a candle. candle. You guys, you're so smart. <laughs> All right. You think you'll get this one? I don't know. I do. We're, all right, listen, we're pretty to look at and we're so nice to smell. Mm, if you have a garden, you know us well. What are we? I think it's French fries. <laughs> Are you ready to yell, French fries? Let, let's all practice. Ready? One, two, three. French fries. That was very good. Ready? French fries. I think those are French fries. I don't know. They look like French fries to me. I know. I know they're pretty flowers. All right, ready? 
This is a hard one. We have three wheels and a horn to blow. Just pedal and pedal, then off we go. What am I? What do you pedal down the street? I don't even know. Let's see. I'm going to close my eyes. You tell me what it is. No, you tell us what it is. Uh, okay. What do I pedal going down the street? Uh, skateboard. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, a tricycle. Who has a tricycle like that? You have one? All right. All right, the next one is so, so hard. When rain comes falling from the sky, open me up. If you want to stay dry. An umbrella? Do you open up an umbrella to stay dry? I think it's a roof. Are you ready to say roof? Yeah. Can you do a count? Um, ready? Um, you guys, I didn't guess any so far, and you got them all right. All right, this is a really, really hard one. You're never going to guess. All right, let's see. When the rain is gone, and the sun peeks through. I'm the colorful surprise rainbow. that's waiting for you. Rainbow. Did you ever see a rainbow? Yes. No. No? Um, I think it's the sun. Ready? I'm going to close my eyes. You just tell me what it is. You're yeah, right. I'm going to tell you something. So the next page is, is going to be really hard for you. Really hard for the next page is going to be really hard for me. <laughs> All of the pages are hard for me. All right. Listen. Dip the wand and gently blow. Bubble. Bubble. Off we sail. Then pop, we go. Bubble. 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 Bubbles. Yeah. It's a star. No. You blow like this on a bubble? Yeah. All right, I'm going to say, I'll close my eyes, but I know you're going to say it's a star. Oh my goodness. Did you get any wrong? No. Did I get any wrong? Yes. <laughs> All of them? All right. This is a hard one. I don't think you're going to get it. I have string and a tail and I'm made to fly on a breezy day. See me up in the sky. No. What is it? It flies up in the sky. A kite? A kite? Oh, you guys are wrong. I think it's a mouse. What am I? What do you think it is? What do you think it is? Somebody tell me. A kite? All right, let's see. Hi. Well, there's its tail. You no. All right. Does it have string and a tail, right? All right. Oh, you'll never get this one. I'm sweet and I'm cold, so take a lick. But watch me melt if you're not quick. Ice cream. Ice cream doesn't melt. I think it's a 
think it's a lollipop that melts. Yeah. Ready? Lollipop. Oh my goodness. All right. All right, ready for this one? I am a trickster. Listen to me, listen to me. Clickety clack. Watch for me, watch for me. Coming down the trap. Choo choo! You should guess it right. I think it's a car. I don't think, I don't know if I want to read this anymore. No, All right, this is the hardest one ever. No. Listen to the clues. You're almost at the end of me. Just one more page to go. I hope you'll share this with a friend. What am I? Do you know? My goodness, you guys are really good. Who thinks it's a book? Me. I don't think anyone has ever guessed that one. So let's turn the page and see. Oh, it's a book. You guys were the best. You guessed every single one. You did such a great job. No. All right, let's sing one more song before story time is finished. What would you like? Let's do Pearly Shelves. We haven't done that in a long time. Ready? Yes. Pearly shells, pearly shells, from the ocean, from the ocean, shining in the sun, shining in the sun, covering the shore, covering the shore. When I see them, when I see them, my heart tells me that I love you more than all those little pearly shells, pearly shells. Well, I'm so happy that everybody came today. Thank you for coming, and I'll see you again next week. You want to sing? You can sing. Oh, let's everybody turn around and wave to Erica and...